community is brought to you by Carriage Crossing Senior Living. Caring for a loved one who may be living with memory loss isn't easy. It can take a toll on them as well as their caregiver. It's really important to have a good support system, and Carriage Crossing Senior Living offers that and more. Executive Director Brenda Hearn joins us to talk about a number of great things that you guys have to offer not only uh, patients, but those who are caring for these patients. Absolutely. So, yeah, I just want to talk about our support services for caregivers. Um, if you have a loved one or you're caring for someone with dementia, you definitely need a care team. Uh, so people to help you and support you in your efforts. So um, we, we truly focus on a purposeful life for our residents, um, but we offer some additional services to help support caregivers who are caring for loved ones at home with dementia. Let's talk a little bit about respite care because yeah. that's a great option, especially in the summertime when families may want to go on a vacation or need a vacation from, from the life that they're living now with a, a loved one suffering. Correct. So a so. respite stay is a short-term stay, usually 30 days or less. You would pack just like if you were going to a hotel. Uh, so the room is furnished with everything from furniture to, you know, all the things that you would need um, uh, on a day-to-day -day basis. So you would pack clothes, toiletries, things like that. And so we do a respite state. We offer that so that caregivers can have time to get away with their families, go on vacation, or do, you know, do those kinds of things. The other way that we support them is through adult daycare services. So our adult daycare services run Monday through Friday, 7 a.m. to 7 p.m. at the Arcola property. We have two locations, one in Arcola, one in Champaign. Champaign doesn't have the adult day services at this time, but the Arcola location does. Um, so adult day services, respite stay, and then in addition to that, we do um, Alzheimer support group meetings. So um, at our, the Arcola location, we do that weekly. It's every Wednesday morning at 10 a.m. And in the Champaign property, it's one, uh, one week out of the month. So it's a monthly meeting. I believe it's the last Wednesday of the month, um, but you can go to our website to find out the specific details on those. Oh, well, it says right there, last Wednesday of every month. There, there you go. Yeah, you were yeah, correct. Uh, speaking of things that happen once a month, and I, I happen to notice monocles on my little sheet of paper here, and my, my brain is drawn to food. Uh, tell us about what you guys are doing in conjunction with monocles. Right. So actually, um, Harbor Light Hospice is a hospice company that is a, a resource that we use, and many of our residents and families um, use it. They offer their services throughout the community, not just through Carriage Crossing. But they have partnered with us in doing a monthly luncheon. So if you're a caregiver and you have someone with dementia you're caring for, going out to lunch and being able to go and do social things and bring your loved one with you is kind of difficult, but this is actually designed and tailored to allow for that so that um, there's going to be food, there's going to be entertainment, and just a nice time to get together and socialize with others, other caregivers. Um, your loved one that has dementia will be in the presence of other people who have dementia, so it's not going to be an uncomfortable situation for the caregiver or the individual, and it's really just to rally around and support caregivers caring for loved ones with dementia. It's amazing to me the similarities, uh, because I haven't lived it, thankfully, um, between having a, a young child mm -hmm. and some of the stresses that go with that mm -hmm. and caring for someone who has dementia or Alzheimer's. Yeah, There's a lot of those same concerns, it seems like. Sure, sure. So it can be challenging. So going out to dinner or going out um, and doing social things together, uh, it just takes a little bit more time, a lot of patience. And uh, so we want to, again, uh, Harbor Light Hospice is partnering with Carriage Crossing to offer this event. So that is going to be uh, July 31st at the Monocles uh, restaurant in Arcola. Yeah. Great. A great service, having gone through it. Yes, you definitely want to take advantage of any opportunity to get that support, and it's wonderful that we have it so close to home here in Central Illinois. Brenda, thank you so much. You're welcome. We'll have all the details on the um, luncheon as well as everything happening at carriagecrossing at CIliving.tv.